or rather, uh, hey everybody, how's it going today? Uh, it's me, Chris, uh, and as you know, today is something of a holiday. Um, so it is April 20th right now. Uh, that means there are adults that are watching uh, me right now, and maybe you're not completely sober. That's totally fine. Uh, I am sober today, but I'm gonna be showing you something cool. So this is Cuphead, uh, and this is one of the trippiest games you'll ever see. Uh, so uh, this is a silly thing I do, but on holidays, I like to, ha to have some fun with my, uh, my uh, audience. I like to play some video games with them. And uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing today. Um, so everybody, if you can, uh, can you just, or, hang on, let me just check something out. Okay. Okay, it does look like I'm streaming, okay. Okay, cool. So, um, yeah, if anybody doesn't know, uh, Cuphead is a game. Um, this is all hand animated to uh, look like it was drawn in the 1930s. Uh, and it's amazing. And it's one of my favorites. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to be beating the game on Expert. And that's rather hard. So we're going to get to it. And also the thing I want you to notice is there are these run and gun levels. Um, and, yeah, I do those... Um, without taking damage, because that's how you're supposed to. So, without further ado, let's get started with some Cuphead. Uh, and if you have any comments, uh, please throw in the comments. Let me know if you are celebrating today, you kids, with your your jazz cigarettes and your groovy gummies. Um, rock on! You know, uh, you're an adult, uh, it's legal, and uh, yeah, let's play some Cuphead. So first we're going to start with Botanic Panic. Uh, we're on. We're gonna start on the easy levels here, right? So let's just see how these go. A brawl is surely brewing. Take on. Okay, so this potato guy isn't bad. Okay, I already took some damage. That's not good. Oh man, I'm usually much better at this. I'm like a little nervous right now. Okay, potato's dead. Now we've got an onion. He's gonna cry. It's okay, feel no sympathy for him. He's trying to get us. Oh man, that's not good. Okay, uh, now we gotta beat this carrot guy. I really like this guy. He's very silly. You can tell this game is very ridiculous. You can probably see why I love it. Uh, the real reason why I love this game, though, is because it was incredibly inefficient. Uh, again, this is all hand animated. So uh, this took years and years and years, as often the greatest uh, works of art do take. Um, let's see here. I'm just going to blast Mr. Carrot away. Yeah, got him. Okay. Just move this. I'm gonna move this out of the way so I can see my health bar. Um, but yeah, welcome everybody. That was level one. All right. So I didn't do great, uh, but I passed. I passed, and that's the important part, right? So. Um, this is part of what I'm doing when I'm not working. I, I sometimes I, I'm not working, surprisingly. Uh, and yeah, games like this kind of help keep my mind sharp. Uh, so weigh in. If anybody wants to let me know what kind of uh, video games you're playing, or maybe if you've got some plans for April 20th and you're blowing off some steam today, uh, let me know. So uh, let's just continue this on. Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to equip a super. And yeah, I'm going to switch my weapons here. Okay, so this is Ribbian Croaks. Two frogs. Again, World 1, Cuphead. Uh, shouldn't be that hard. Let's just see how it goes. Here's a real high-class bout.
Okay, and you can see here, uh, any object that's pink can be parried. And parries are good, they build up. And uh, yeah, you want, you want those. Now I'm gonna hit him with my super. Get those frogs. And you know, the idea here is just, you just gotta blast him as hard as you can. That's all you gotta do. Hit him with the super again. I like this converge shot, because I can hit him with three beams at the same time. Oh yeah, you don't like that, do you, Froggy? Yeah, I love this game because the animation is so ridiculous. It follows like the old-timey kind of animation where nothing makes sense. <laughs> it's all absurd, and the characters just turn. They just transform into ridiculous things, depending on the comedy needs of the moment. And I'm into it. You know, I am into it. I am into weird, creative, unexpected stuff, which is why I love this game. I don't know how to see comments here. I should figure that out. Once I beat this boss, I'll find a way to turn comments on. I'm broadcasting with OBS today, too, which is not something I'm used to doing. Um... Maybe it did work. Maybe he's almost dead. Oh no, he got me. Okay. Probably almost dead. I keep getting the red one. Which is not my favorite. Got him. Okay, cool. Let's see here. <laughs> Lynn says, feels frantic like you're drinking coffee. Yeah, this game is relentless. Um, let's see here. Can I see comments in the chat? No, I don't think I can. Let's see here. Okay. All right, cool. Yeah, so welcome, everybody. Who's uh, who's here playing some Cuphead today? It's my new favorite game. Um, and yeah, if you have any opinions on what you're seeing, or you know, if you just wanna uh, wish me a happy 420, again, I'm I'm not smoking today, but if you are, rock on. That's super cool. And yeah, basically the premise of this game is Cuphead and his brother Mugman uh, sold their soul to the devil. And uh, now they have to uh, pay their dues by going and collecting the souls of other unfortunate characters uh, who, who uh, sold their souls to the devil. So, um, yeah, let's just keep this rolling then. Um, and let's do a run and gun level. So, like I mentioned before, run and guns, um, these are hard because, uh, well, they're just hard in general. But if you want to get the highest score, you have to do, you have to get a P, which is where you don't kill anybody. It's a pacifist. So, I'm going to be trying to. Uh, complete this next level without shooting any bullets or damaging anybody. Um, let's see if I can get a, a, a pacifist rank on uh, on this run and gun level. This is Cuphead, Chris Bogues, uh, 420 party on LinkedIn and YouTube and everything. So I'm playing with Miss Chalice, who's like a character you can only get. Oh no. Oh lord, there's so much chaos. Um, you can only get this character with the DLC, so I went and I unlocked her before the stream began. Um, so I, I would save some time. Um, but normally you don't start the game with her. Oh no. Wait, why do I have so much health? Well, whatever, it doesn't matter. Okay. <laughs> Gotta play more carefully, Chris. No, okay. I gotta get out of here. Almost done. There's this acorn maker. I don't like it. I think I have to take damage here. 
All right, just don't die again, Chris. Oh no, okay. I died, okay. So as you can see, this is kind of tricky, right? So uh, I'm kind of like running through it a little fast. Maybe I should slow down a little bit. Oh, also I've got me in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen, which makes it kind of hard to see things. Maybe I'll just let them pass. Oh, flower man, okay. Lordy. Why do I have so many lives? Oh, I think I did a hack where I accidentally got a bunch of lives. So I guess it's kind of like cheating. But whatever. It was an accident. <laughs> I spun around and it gave me a bunch of extra lives. She can also do this thing where you roll on the ground and you don't take damage. It's super useful. Jeez. In the home stretch. Don't die again, Chris. This is where you died last time. Okay. Looks like we're getting close. Did it. All right, sweet. Um, all right, there we go. So, yeah, this game was invented by two brothers just following their dreams paying homage to the cartoons they used to watch when they were little kids. And something about it really speaks to me. You know, they learned how to animate specifically so they could create this game from scratch. And just that level of commitment is just something that's just, I don't know, uh, wonderful to me. This, this, this game just kind of warms my heart. And uh, let's go buy some weapons here. Why not? I like that guy. I like all these old school characters. Something about it where it's kind of equal parts cute, but a little dark and a little satirical is like just my style. But yeah, let's keep it rolling. We're going to fight this guy now. Um, let me switch what I'm working with here. Yeah, okay, this is Goopy the ground. Oh no! accidentally switched it. Hang on. Okay, I've got to go switch it to uh, expert again. I accidentally goofed up. So, uh, in the meantime, welcome. I know this was short notice here, but if anybody wants to just, like, weigh in in the comments with where you're from, I don't know if you're here if you don't say anything, you know? So, uh, excuse me for a moment. I just got to be able to switch the game back to expert because I'm exploiting a glitch. Normally, you have to beat the entire game on regular first then you can beat it on expert, but if you go and you switch it to expert on another save file, uh, you're fine. So here. Okay, remind me not to switch the difficulty. That's very bad. Okay. Now I'm going to exit back to the map. Now I should be able to do this. False alarm, everybody. Sorry about that. Yeah, I, I tried to, like, preload everything so it was, like, just super smooth and I could just run through the game. And, of course, nothing's ever easy. Nothing in life is ever easy. Okay, we're going to beat Goopy Legrand. It's a very silly boss fight. See, he's basically just a big blob. You know, that's kind of cool. You'll see. I don't want to spoil anything for you, but there he is.
Roxy. Look at this guy. What a freaking scumbag. We're gonna get him. Bouncing around like he owns the place. Oh no, he hit me. He's like the easiest boss in the game. I should not be taking damage. Okay, here we go. Now he's gonna get real big. I'm gonna parry his... Oh, no! Okay. So yeah, I thought I was gonna S-rank this guy. Not necessarily. Guess I'm a little rusty. I love all the music in this game, too. You can, like... You can hear this is all supposed to sound like 1930s jazz. And they did this all with a big band and composed all these numbers from scratch. And they're all amazing. They all sound super cool. They even recorded them on vintage microphones, you know? Just, like, there's something about the attention to detail on this game that just, like, I'm mesmerized by it. All right, Goopy, you're dead. No? Okay, there we go. Boom. Yeah, Rob? Uh, yeah, I am taking this to LinkedIn because, like, who cares? Right? It's 420. I'm sure half the people on LinkedIn, they're, they're baked out on, on uh, wacky sticks, you know? And, and really, is this any less educational or less professional than any other content you see on LinkedIn? Probably not, you know? Um, LinkedIn is, is uh, I mean, I love it, but it's, it's mostly garbage, you know? And that's fine. Um, let's just keep this party going. So, you see here, I'm beating the game. Uh, if anybody uh, doesn't know what I'm doing, this game is called Cuphead. Uh, it's famously difficult, um, but it's a lot of fun. So uh, I'm going through and I'm beating the game on Expert because it's 420. And sometimes adults need an excuse to relax, you know? So I am not smoking marijuana today, uh, but if you are, that's totally cool, you know? I'm going to be uh, completing this game now. And uh, now I'm going to fight the next boss, whose name is Hildeberg. So you're going to see, she's kind of modeled a little bit off Betty Boop. Um, and yeah, this is actually a pretty difficult boss fight, so wish me luck, everybody. A great slam and then some. Now I'm in an airplane. Ugh. Oh no, I forgot this boss is hard. Okay, so now she's gonna transform. And she turns into like other constellations. So at first she turns into a Gemini. This one's not that annoying. It's a little bit annoying, but she's gonna get more annoying. Oh, I thought I would be able to hear that. She's gonna get more annoying as the fight goes on. see this game is it's just pure insanity there's always just a bunch of stuff coming at you it's very crazy and as you can imagine it takes some time to learn these patterns and it's very frustrating when you don't know <laughs> it's you're gonna die like thousands of times you first play this game okay now this one's really hard this guy drives me nuts the Sagittarius he's got these little stars that follow you around now I'm going to try to hit him with a missile. Buy myself some time. Yeah, I got to, like, chase. His little stars chase you around, which is a huge pain. But I got him. Oh, no. All right. I've only got one, one HP left. It's not looking good, folks, but wish me luck. I got to do the rest of this one flawless. Okay, hit her with the missile. All right, now this is her final phase. Don't get scared. But uh, yeah, this is this is it gets pretty tough here. Ah, okay. First death. First death of the run, or maybe it's the second one. It's the second death of the run. It's fine. We're gonna get her this time, right, gang? I'm gonna be super careful. I'm gonna hit my parries. 
you know what? It's pretty hard to do Cuphead without dying. So, wish me luck. Uh, you know, if, if you want to chime in and say, Hey, Chris, you're supposed to be working. This is kind of like work. You know, I've actually landed clients from doing this before. Oh, man, I'm so screwed. I've already taken damage twice. Ah, oh, man, this is so hard. Okay. It's all right. Don't get freaked out. All we got to do is beat the Sagittarius and the crazy ending. I'm sure that'll be easy, right? Okay. All right. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> All right, this time we got it. This time we got it, everybody. I just gotta be like super careful. timing okay good we're, we're good we're good all right come on Sagittarius okay so now this guy's tricky again but we got him we got him remember I'm missing all my parries which is not good all right sweet I'm gonna hit him gonna knock out all the stuff in one shot A lot of close calls. Ah, it spoke too soon. Okay. All right. Man, I'm so scared. Okay. Perry. That's it. Going to hit her with the missile. All right. Final phase, everybody. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so the trick is you gotta dodge all these stars. You gotta get your parries. You can't let her face pop out and hit you. And now there's these UFOs. So pay attention to the color of the UFO because I gotta swing underneath the red ones and I gotta trigger the brown ones early. Is how you do the timing on those. All right, I'm gonna just eat some damage. Hit her with another one of those. Trigger the brown one. Zip under the red ones. this. <laughs> Got it. Okay. <sighs> yeah, Lynn, as a Gemini, I am multitasking. That's me. I'm full of contradictions. Sometimes I'm very serious, and then sometimes I'm really silly. Okay. So that's pretty good. We're doing good. Everybody who's joining us, it's 420. We are playing Cuphead on Expert on LinkedIn for God only knows what reason, okay? You kids love your marijuana. You know, you're all high in the head. Why don't you just watch some delightful video gameplay? We're going to beat Cuphead together. And uh, now I'm going to do this thing where um, I actually beat this boss already, but I'm going to play it again. Um, just because, like, you weren't here. Uh, but, like, I had to play this originally to unlock Miss Chalice. But we'll just do it again so you can watch. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> that was intense. Um, this one's going to be intense, too. So, again, I cannot take damage here. Uh, these run and gun levels, if I want to get the highest score, I cannot take damage. We got Woody Woodpecker over here. Got 
I hate these bees. I do like these tree stump guys, though. I think they're cool looking. Oh, no! Alright, it's not so good. Can I not jump on anything? guy you know what I'm not even playing with you not even playing with you mr. dragonfly right, so. now, once again I uh, attain the P rank that is what you want for the levels that are not boss fights, the best thing you can do is attack nobody. That is how you get the highest score. So we're doing good. We're beating Cuphead on Expert. We're P-ranking, getting a pacifist rank on the run and gun levels. And now we're going to go face uh, another challenging boss. Let's do this setup. Okay, so this is Cagney Carnation. I hate this boss fight, but I love his music. I think this is a really cool boss fight. You're going to see... Uh, I love playing this song, too. I play it on my Winston sometimes. Okay, so I'm going to hit him with this crack shot because this is the best shot in the game. And it homes in so I don't have to aim. But yeah, you see he's got all these little monsters that come out, and they are just a nightmare. Once again, you can see anything that's pink on the screen can be parried. Doing this. You know what, Mr. Mr. Plant Boy? Do your worst. Do your worst. Oop! Okay. Oh no! I wasted that! I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> okay. It's alright. Oh, man, I thought I could- Oh no! I thought I could time that! Oh man, okay. I got this now. I made a couple mistakes there, gang, but it's alright. We're going to get Cagney. We're playing Cuphead because it's 420. Maybe you're on drugs, maybe you're not. But you know what? Cuphead is kind of a game that makes you feel like you're on drugs, you know? This feels like it's it's some old-timey, ragtime uh, hallucination, you know? Um, so enjoy it. And uh, we're just having some fun today. We're cutting loose. It's 420. It's a holiday. Uh, and it's a holiday for adults, well, which is my favorite kind of holiday, you know. Uh, children, they don't have 420 parties. They're not cool enough yet to do that. But we can do that, even though we're on LinkedIn, you know. So I'm fighting Cagney Carnation. I'm beating Cuphead on Expert. It's hard, but I just, you know, love you people. I love everybody on LinkedIn without exception, you know, except the, for the people that I don't. And, uh... We don't have to go into who that is. Okay, good. I'm just going to hit him with these blasts. Uh, I, I used to... There was some timing that I used to know. Now, I'm not going to get fancy with that. I'm just going to dodge around. 
No! Okay. There we go. All right, got him. Yeah, Lynn, so it's funny because the, the animators who actually animated this, um, yeah, they, like, they were modeling it off of Fleischer Studios, which is, like, the cartoonists that brought us, like, Popeye and Betty Boop. And yeah, uh, they were just doing animation wrong back in the day. These, these characters don't really make a whole lot of sense, um, which is why they're great. They can just morph into whatever the, the game needs them to be in terms of attacks. Um, cool. So let's keep it going. Sweet. So I got Cagney's soul. I'm collecting souls for the devil, too. That's the premise of this game. Um... And hey, look at that. We just beat uh, aisle one of Cuphead. So one down, two more to go, and then uh, maybe we'll do the DLC. Who knows? So this is King Dice. I like him. He's going to take us to the next level. Okay, our dad, uh, Elder Kettle, he's going to give us some wide, wise words. But we don't need to watch the whole story. The story doesn't really matter. All that matters is we're going to watch cool things on screen because I assume some percentage of my fans are high. And I want to give them something fun to do on 420. So uh, let's continue here. Okay, so we've got some fun boss fights coming up. So now I've got bombs on my plane. Uh, okay, now we've got Baroness Von Bonbon, who I love. This level's insane, um, but I really like the animation on this character. She is just zany. Uh, and I don't know. Something about this level just kind of tickles me. Plus, it's got a Barry Sachs theme meal here, which I love. The trickiest part of this level is actually the jelly beans. If you watch, there's these little jelly beans that come out of the castle. And that's really what makes it hard. That's what's going to kill you. Okay, so got him down. I'm going to kill this Pac-Man thing. Ugh. Making progress, making progress. No. Gumball guy got me, seriously? Oh no! Okay, I gotta be really good here. Okay, don't get scared. But yeah, she's pretty crazy here. Oh no. Okay, yeah, you can see this boss fight is pretty insane. But I made some stupid mistakes. I'm gonna be a lot smarter this time around. Oh God, this muffin. Lord, help me the muffin. He's usually the hardest one. That was close. All right. Let's go. Come on, Baroness. What do you got for me? God, 
I love how insane this game is. No! I spoke too soon. Three HP. I think we got a better shot this time. What? Where'd my head? Okay. Well. To just get insanely lucky a couple times in a row there, so count your blessings, Chris. Oh no! Yes! Okay, that was super close. That was closer than I wanted it to be, but we did it. Baroness von Bonbon, done. Okay. For those of you just joining us, it's 420. I am playing Cuphead on Expert. Why? Y who knows? You know, I just think this is entertaining. Uh, and I always like to do something for the holidays. And this is a holiday whether or not you like it. You know, all you marketing experts out there want to email me about National Hamburger Day or whatever. I can go ahead and celebrate 420 in whatever way is appropriate to me. Um... So now we're going to do another boss fight that I love. This is a fun one. This is Jimmy the Great. This is another airplane level. And now I have bombs. They just equip bombs on my airplane, which is cool. So I'm going through. This is expert mode, cuphead. I'm beating the game. Because we got to relax sometimes, gang. Oh, Lord, the cats. No, I already got hit. That's not good. Man, I hate these cats. I'm so screwed. Okay. I've only got one... HP left, gang, so I gotta fly really well for the rest of this, and there's a lot of boss fight left. This part's annoying. This is like the easiest part, it's still hard. Oh no, okay. Wish me luck, gang. This one's hard. Okay. No more cats, please. God bless it. No, I'm so dumb. I just can't with all these cats. Oh no, there's more cats. All right, I'm just retrying it. No more cats. Give me something easier, Jimmy. Okay. Let's see how I do with the swords. Okay, remember, I can parry anything that's pink, so... Ugh. What? Well, I got him with a missile. Alright. Slightly better last time. I'm doing bad this time. Ugh, so hard. Okay. I love this phase, even though it's crazy. I think this boss fight is so funny. It's just absolutely ridiculous. Okay. Two more phases left. So we got a couple. Okay, he's going to show up now and try to scare me. Okay, now 
this is a little bit tricky. He's got this cuphead puppet. Oh no, I wasted my missile. Okay. All right, one last phase. God bless it. Got him. Take that, Jimmy. All right, if anybody wants to weigh in, uh, this is Cuphead. I'm beating the game to celebrate 420 because you need crazy stuff to watch today, right? Um, so I'm not smoking, but smoke them if you got them. You know, whatever. It's legal now. The drug war was a bad idea. You know, we're trying to do better. Uh, and 420 is a day where people can actually just, like, chill out. Great, so we got him. Let's go. Oh no, okay, so we wanna go, let's see here. Okay, we got Beppy the Clown next. He's kinda creepy, but not too creepy. Nothing in this game is too creepy. The, the instant it's about to be too creepy, they make it kind of cute. And I like that. So here we go. Evil clown. What are you going to do? We got some ducks up there. Yeah, and mostly he's just going to try to hit me with his car. She's getting a little close for my taste. Got to make sure the duck doesn't drop a light bulb on me. Okay. Well, there's this roller coaster coming. Which is good because I can parry it. If my timing is right. Ugh. Do not like taking damage. Get him while he's on his donkey. Mm. Okay, it could have been worse. Got him. All right, final phase. Let's get him. Faster. Just gonna keep focused. Beppy the Clown, consider him dead. This is uh, Cuphead on Expert for 420. We're beating the game together. We're having fun. It's old timey. There's jazz. It's all my favorite things. This game makes me so happy. If you're in the comments, if you're enjoying today, uh, maybe you just finished up work. Maybe you just rolled a, a gigantic blunt. You know, whatever you kids do these days, rock on. Um, 
And yeah, I'm just kind of beating the Cuphead game. So I know where all the secrets are. So these guys are sad. The Barbershop Quartet lost one of their members. It's okay, guys. We're going to find him right now. There he is. Okay, so we found him. That's good. Now we have another Funhouse level. So, uh, as a reminder, I'm doing all these Funhouse levels as a pacifist. So I'm not allowed to uh, give any damage during this run. So let's just see how it goes. Uh, can I beat it without f hurting a single baddie? This is Cuphead. It's on. get a prize if you parry something four times in a row. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is more than I bargained for. Okay. I had to do that. You'll understand someday why I did that. No, that was foolish. Okay. just can't. Okay, one HP left. Don't ruin it, Chris. Mm. Jeez, that was close. Okay. All right, hot dog man. We don't like ketchup on our hot dogs in Chicago. You just got eaten. All right. Give me that P rank, son. Pacifist. Okay, I'm actually going to do this out of order because there's a secret now. If I go behind the level and find the shortcut, this is a secret. So first I'm going to go to this guy. This guy's name is Buster. He wanted me to get those four parries, which I did. Which means I get a coin. And now I'm going to fight... Grim Matchstick. This is Cuphead on Expert. Celebrating 420 because we're adults and we can do whatever we want. If we want to go play video games on LinkedIn, who's going to stop us? The LinkedIn police? No. Sorry, gang. We can't just talk about ChatGPT. Sometimes we got to get this dragon, you know? Fire guys are annoying. Okay, 
final phase. No! Okay. So if you hit his fireballs, they split and turn into multiple fireballs, which is annoying. But it's okay. We're going to get him. Go, you walk away, you fly away. Jeez, okay, gotta try to not take any damage from the little fire dudes, because the ending is hard. No! I just said I wasn't gonna take damage. Of his fireballs. Oh no! Okay. We're gonna get it. This is one of the hardest boss fights in the game, so um, I just gotta be a little bit more patient. Run. You run away. Man. Always gets me. Okay. No. just gonna wait it out. I'm gonna cheese him. I don't care. I got an ego to defend. I want to look like I'm good at this game. I can't keep dying. Got him. We're beating Cuphead. We're doing it. We're doing it. Uh, if you're just joining us, it's April 20th. I mean, some people today are smoking a little bit of wacky tobacco, which means I'm playing Cuphead uh, because it's cool to watch. This is one of my favorite video games. It's very creative, and, uh, you know, why not? I mean, what are you doing? You're sitting here watching me. I mean, how, how important could your job really be, you know? Um, i got to beat these ghosts now, so I'm going to turn back into Mugman. i got to parry, so if anybody doesn't know the mechanics of this game, anybody who's pink, anytime there's a pink object, you can parry them. And uh, parries are good. And this one, you have to parry them. You can't let anyone touch this vase in the middle.
Got it. Okay, cool. Sweet. Okay. Hey, Miss Chalice, how's it going? Sweet. All right, this is Cuphead. Super cool game. Super hard, too. This is known for being... I know it looks like it's very easy for me to do this. This is not easy when you're first playing this game. It's pretty difficult. Um, so let's see here. Oh, I still got to beat Wally Warbles. Okay, so this guy... <laughs> oh, boy, Wally Warbles. Okay. This is another one where it's one of the hardest fights in the game, so wish me luck. Yes, okay, hit him with the old missile. Now he turns into a steam whistle. He's not happy, so now I gotta deal with this insanity. It only gets harder from here, too. I hate to burst your bubble. Blow him up, blow him up, baby. Okay, now his son comes out. So I don't have enough garbage to deal with in this level. Oh man, okay, that was a bad move. I got another parry, which is good. Okay. It's gonna be tough, gang. Oh no! Okay. Whew. All right. This is one of the hardest. Like Wally might be the hardest boss in the game. He's one of the hardest. So I might. Okay. I'm. I'm just gonna restart right away. Okay. This one takes me a little bit usually. This is Cuphead on expert. The old face missile. <sighs> Get steamed up. I don't even care. Saving, saving the bomb this time, so I can use it here. I just hate this phase. Final phase. Wish me luck, gang. Oh, that wasn't good. All right. No! 
Ah, okay. I'm gonna need all. I need to eat my Wheaties before this one, gang. you this Boyd uh, he's got some gumption so crouchy I said this one's really hard. Literally getting sweaty doing this. I usually don't have like lamps on my face as I'm doing this, but content! Him. Okay, final phase. He's hurt. He's suffering. Let's let's just rub some salt in the wound, shall we, gang? Hit him with the old bomb ski. His heart's gonna come out of his chest. We love seeing that. He's gonna shoot some garbage at me, as you do. Hey, buddy, I'm a LinkedIn content creator. You wanna shoot some garbage at me? I've been there. Got him. Okay. So you can see that was pretty hard. I'm 
but hey, we're moving along now. is a hidden coin back here and we got another run and gun level so we're gonna try to do this without giving any damage so the goal here is a pacifist rank don't hurt anybody don't kill anybody welcome to the game by the way it's 420 we're hanging out we're playing cuphead uh you come join me in the comments So that was tricky because you can flip the gravity upside down. Uh, and oftentimes you do it accidentally when you don't want to. And remember, I can't hurt any bad guys here. That's the whole point is to get a, a pacifist rank. Which makes things harder. I gotta restart because at the end I'm gonna have to take damage. It's on. Dumb move, Chris. You're supposed to be winning. That's how this game works. The winners are the ones that die less. Okay. 